And to bring even more optimization, well, why should you only work with one terminal at a time? Actually, if you look at the screen of anyone working with Linux systems, you will usually see a lot of different terminals running at the same time. And this is super useful. You can, for example, edit a file in one terminal, run a program on another one, and then keep another one to find files, another one to monitor resources, etc, etc. Having multiple terminal windows directly available in front of your eyes is going to make you much more productive. So well, the first thing you can do is just open multiple terminals and for example, arrange them like this and then a new window. Okay, so for example, you can just arrange them as you want and add many different terminals to your screen. So that's number one option. Then what you can also do inside one window is to use Control, Shift and T. And that is going to open a new tab. So basically here on that window, I have two tabs, I have two terminals. Okay, Control, Shift and T. I can have as many tabs as I want. So that also can be useful. And then you have other programs. So for example, you have the TMUX program. So TMUX that you can install and check how it's working. I'm not going to cover that now, but that's one also uh, one available option to have multiple, basically multiple terminals inside your terminal. And I'm going to show you another way to get that. I'm going to first to close uh, this. So I'm going to use the program that is called Terminator. Okay, so I'm going to actually open a terminal to install Terminator with sudo apt install Terminator. Okay, you put your password, you put yes. And then, well, Terminator has been installed. So how to start it? Well, you can just run Terminator like this in the terminal and press enter. Or you can also go here or in your program and search for Terminator, you can see you have Terminal and Terminator. And you have a new window, you can see the font and text is different, okay, from the terminal here, but that's basically just a new bash window, you can see with add, okay, at add-vm, that's exactly the same thing you have here. Now what I can do is I can also put that to favorites with right click. So now if I uh, kill it, you can see I still have here. I'm going to stop this terminal. And so if I open the Terminator, you can see, so I'm going to put it a bit bigger. We can have many different windows actually inside that window. So if you do right click and for example, split horizontally, it's going to open two terminals like this. Okay, that's very useful and you can resize them as you want. Okay, now I can do right click split vertically to have more. Okay, and I can add as many as I want. Okay, and the shortcut for that is Control Shift and O. So if I do Control Shift and O, that's going to split horizontally. And if I do Control Shift and E, that's going to split vertically. Okay, so with that, you can see you have really full control over what you want to uh, display on your screen. You can go full screen like this and just display what you want. And that may sound like complicated, but it's not. You just have one, two, three, four, five, six terminals just running here, and you just run any command you want in any terminal. If you want to put one terminal for a moment in full screen, okay, you can do Control Shift and X. Okay, and you can see you have full screen of just the terminal. And if you do Control Shift and X again, terminal is going to go back here, and you're gonna go to the uh, main view. And now I'm going to show you a few preferences. So you right click and you can go to preferences. And so you can change uh, different options. Okay, I let you see what options you have here. And for example, here you can choose to use the system font or you can uh, also change it to increase it. So let's say I'm going to use so the Ubuntu regular, but with size, let's say um, 18. Select close and you can see now I have text which is bigger if you ls you can see that's bigger you can right click again and let's say you want to save this uh, layout okay for the next time because if you start again so if I do new window you're just gonna get this okay and then you need to do the layout again so you can do right click preferences layout and then add 
and then just new layout just uh, put a name let's say test enter and you have a new layout here okay close and now if i open a new window in that window i can do alt and l and i have a pop-up here with the layout i want to choose so test launch and you can see now i'm back to my layout so terminator is actually a program that i use really quite often okay because it's super convenient to organize your window with different terminals okay you can resize them you can make them full screen you can well you can do many different things and you can customize the colors the font the size anything as you want okay so to conclude on that section you have seen a few comments for example find and grep that are going to help you find stuff on the terminal and make you go faster and then with pipes you can chain different comments okay to get even more powerful comments then you have seen some shortcuts to go faster on the terminal and also how to basically work with multiple terminals on the same screen. And that's the end of this section on how to work more efficiently with the terminal.